This video shows how a chemical recycling process for polystyrene looks like and includes interviews from experts. Here we see a bale in which polystyrene is highly enriched. For technical and economic reasons, impurities like other plastics that impair quality and or disrupt the downstream process must be accepted in such a pre-concentrate to ensure that this material can be treated in the depolymerization process without any problems it must be conveyable we achieve this by milling the clean product to less than 30 millimeters Recycling Technologies is not only a manufacturer, but also a technology expert. We are dedicated to feedstock recycling of mixed plastic waste and we have also recently demonstrated that our technology also works for other polymers, such as polystyrene. The unit here starts with a feeder where the shredded plastic is fed into the system. The plastic then enters a reactor, which is a thermal cracker uh, with a fluidized bed. Heat is supplied here to the plastics entering the reactor and the plastic then gets cracked into vapors. These vapors leave the reactor and then get cooled in the condenser. The condensation products are then collected in product collection bottles. Thanks to the collaboration with the Ineos Styrolution, we are proud to say that we are achieving excellent results with high styrene yields. So even more plastics can now get recycled and go back into the circular economy. Compared to conventional extruder, this twin screw extruder is equipped with a high temperature system and is optimized for the output of gas risk degradation products. The recycled material is fed to the extruder via the dosing and the hopper. In the first part of the extruder, the material is heated to its melting temperature. At the first vacuum dome, a vacuum pump removes moisture and oxygen from the process. The actual depolymerization process begins afterwards. The polystyrene is heated far above its melting temperature. This high energy input allows the polymer chains to be broken, resulting in styrene monomer. This is then present in gaseous form and is drawn off from the twin screw extruder with a vacuum via the second and the third domes. The gas is then transported through these pipes into our separator, condenses there and can be bottled as styrene oil. We are very proud of this partnership with INEOS Styrolution. It shows that Thomas More's applied scientific research is cutting edge in Europe. This partnership will benefit not only our research program, but the education of our chemistry students as well. With the support of INEOS Styrolution, we upgraded our distillation column to increase the separation capacity. This enabled us to purify styrene monomer from the pyrolysis oil obtained from the waste. We are proud that we can collaborate in this sustainable project of chemical recycling. We use purified styrene monomer in our R&D lab to test their performance in different polymerization methods we are using in our company. We identify the disturbing impurities and advise our purification partners. We are testing the purified styrene monomer from the pyrolysis oil in radical, both bulk and emulsion polymerization and anionic polymerization. Definitely the anionic polymerization requires high purities and is challenging. In our state-of-the-art pilot plans, we are scaling up the polymerization of recycled styrene monomer to produce sufficient amounts for performance tests and customer sampling. With this R&D program, INEOS Starilution has brought chemical recycling of styrenic polymers to reality. 
This research shows that polystyrene is almost designed for recycling. The nice conversion of post-consumer plastic waste back to its original building blocks is a fantastic property of styrenic plastics. We are proud that we can contribute to a more sustainable world by the developments in this research program. This not only reconfirms polystyrene's unique and inherent chemical properties that allows it to be recycled again and again, but it's also a huge milestone in our sustainability effort and a core pillar of our sustainability strategy. Driving success together.